West Marine's Life on the Water, presented by Costa Custom Boats. Seward, Alaska. Nestled into the mouth of Resurrection Bay, this town has a rich history of frontier exploration, commercial fishing, as well as being the stop for major cruise ships. It's from here that Brandon and Eric are taking a boat out to the southeastern tip of the bay, where an eco-tourist resort offers a chance to unplug from our always connected lifestyles. So what do you think, Brandon? You know, I think this is probably one of the most incredible views I've ever seen. Just truly, this is one of my favorite places on the planet. Orca Island is this incredible, incredible series of yurts that are built into the cliff at the back of Humpy Cove. And Humpy Cove is basically a fjord that is near the southernmost tip of Resurrection Bay, which is a large bay which basically has mountains coming out of the ocean on both sides. It began with purchasing an acre of land back in 1984. We actually started developing the island portion with yurts starting in 2001. I've never really been to like an actual ecotourism place, you know, where you've got, you know, the compost toilets, you're, you're collecting rainwater for the drinking water or the shower water, you know, it's really just a live off the land kind of vibe. They're in awe once they step onto the dock and they look around with the yurts in the background nestled in the trees. And then when they walk into the yurts themselves, they're surprised by how comfortable they are. They enjoy the accommodations, they enjoy the, uh, the beauty of the area, and they also enjoy the wildlife and the recreational activities that they have because they can kayak, they can paddleboard, they can fish, and they can do that anytime they want, 24 seven. And that's how we're unlike other lodges. Tide is looking good, this should be perfect. Yeah, this is looking awesome. Got a big right, selection bro. of kayaks. Yeah, maybe, um, I think maybe taking one of the, the top guy off over there. I'll take this guy off over here. Beautiful. Which way are we Let's going? Over here, we'll go under the, uh, we'll go under the bridge. This is living. When you're in a kayak, you're sitting so low to the water and everything else around you just seems so massive and you know incredible this is one of these places where it's all these things you can go and do where if you're sitting there you know alaskans call the 48 states the lower 48 right. it's sort of kind of a different dynamic which you recognize you can come here pull up to orca island you know, spend time with dennis and susan the owners and just they're just so unbelievably hospitable absolutely and man. just literally hop in a kayak and the next thing you know you're cruising over to watch salmon spawn coming through there and i think it's Sometimes people can be afraid to go try things. And I think the coolest part about it being something new, you know, obviously you go into something new and you're, I wouldn't even say stressed or worried, but the, the excitement's there, you know. It's so many things in life, like oh, kind of I'm afraid, don't know if I want to do this, mm -hmm. don't know if I want to get out. And every person that we've brought up here to spend time with us, they come away and they, they've all talked about how this is just a different scenario for them right. in terms of, in terms of just having this life experience and recognizing. <laughs> there we go. Yeah, it was yeah. good. Was it was a near miss, close. dude. It was a near miss. <laughs> we worked through that just right. Near miss. I was dodging that iceberg over That's there. Right. You saw it, right? <laughs> exactly. There you go. <laughs> See kind of the stream coming up to the left in that one little slot canyon? Yeah. That's basically it comes down and drives these waterfalls we're going to go check out. So we're pulling up in the kayaks and you know, we're getting towards the back of the cove there and it, you know, you see a little flicker in the water and you look down and there's actually hundreds of salmon back there, you know, spawning, getting ready to spawn, do their thing and they're pretty much packed in there, you know, side by side, swimming together, rolling on top of each other and it was super cool to see and it was like the further you got back, the more they were just, you know, compressed in there. There we go. Woo. All this wildlife, birds. I mean, there's like thousands of these fish. I could just reach over and grab one of these things. <laughs> so let me go try. show you something up here. All right, come with me. What do you mean, there's more to see? This is incredible. Remember that magic I was telling you about? Yeah. Oh. My favorite place. Oh. 
Holy cow, dude! Oh my gosh, dude! Little power there. Yeah, you can feel it. And there's a series of three of them. So you go up, you hike around the backside, and there's three of them up there. 